Welcome to Hook and Look Splash, a splash of angling information with an underwater point of view. This week's splash addresses the importance of understanding what transpires below the surface. Learning to comprehend the underwater environment and identify the food chain will increase your odds of locating and catching quality fish. The ecosystem beneath the surface is indeed a multifaceted neighborhood, which many fishermen fail to recognize. Let's check in with the professor and see what he has to offer. Professor Gerald R. Smith is the curator of fishes at the University of Michigan Museum of Zoology. One of the important things that uh, uh, anglers often miss is just how complicated and how abundant the community is of, uh, that makes up the food chain for, for a bass, for example. So you have fish that feed on the bottom like the suckers, uh, minnows and alewives and things that feed in midwater. All of these things provide babies uh, that some size bass somewhere are just the right size to eat. And so it's really important to have all, the, all those uh, native species that make up the food chain around in order to grow up large bass. Of course, something gets introduced like the round goby, and for years we thought that was a pest. We've seen that somehow the bass have caught on and they're eating them in abundance and growing bigger and more abundant than ever before. So this thing that we regarded as a pest, and it's still kind of a still an introduced pest that we'd rather not have, but it's interesting to see how it's been integrated into the food chain with the help of learning on the part of smallmouth bass. To view additional Splash podcasts, simply visit hookandlook.com.